Now I'm going to show you how to find the factor pairs of a number and what their visual representation looks like after you have found them. You're going to have to recall what we talked about in investigation one about finding the factors of a number. And in order to do that, the first thing you got to do for this example is list the numbers 1 through 12. Once you have listed the 12 numbers, you're going to go through and figure out which numbers are not factors of 12. In this example, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11 are not factors of 12. So you would go ahead and cross them out. If you look at your list, you can match up the factors 1 with 12, 2 with 6, and 3 with 4. These numbers that you have matched up would be called the factor pairs for 12. So if you look at your final result, we see that 12 has three factor pairs, 1 and 12, 2 and 6, 3 and 4. Now to get a visual representation of what this looks like, for 1 and 12, your image would look something like this. Here we have one column by 12 little tiles. Over here would be 12 tiles by one row. In this example, we have two columns by 6. And over here, we have six columns by 2. And the last factor pair looks like this, where we have 4 by 3 or 3 by 4. So I hope this helps clarify what factor pairs are and what they would look like if you had to draw them yourselves. Good luck.